Deborah, I know that the two of you are both very passionate about social entrepreneurship and really making a difference in the world. How do you see yourself using the skills that you have polished in a traditional company in a potentially nonprofit or venture that is focused more on social entrepreneurship than a traditional business? Well, first of all, over the past several years as I've been really focusing on these issues, it's become clear to me that some of the big social problems that I care about, the inequities between rich and poor, a lot of the environmental issues, a lot of the issues that the nonprofit world is currently addressed, cannot be effectively tackled without truly deep collaboration between business nonprofit organizations, and in many cases, government. And so a knowledge of the business environment really helps drive a level of collaboration that goes beyond, you know, give us some money and we'll put your name on our next event or campaign, which is frankly the level at which much collaboration is happening today. The second issue is, I think if you look at a lot of nonprofit organizations that exist today trying to drive social mission, they really lack some of the core skills that enable you to get things done effectively. And there are a bunch of reasons for that. Companies have tended to invest a lot in developing people, in helping people understand how to manage projects, how to manage meetings, how to do a whole bunch of things which are about efficiently driving organizations to accomplish clearly defined goals. That kind of rigor, discipline, those skill sets are in unfortunately short supply in the nonprofit world. And so I think bringing those kinds of capabilities and that kind of perspective to the solving of these social problems can be enormously impactful.